The C-Pen range of portable scanners have helped thousands of people across the globe find reading and learning independence. One of the reasons these devices are such effective tools for so many people is the ability to customize them for individual users. In this video, I'm going to take you through the Setup Wizard's most relevant settings so you can quickly adjust your device to best fit your learning needs. In this demonstration, I'll be using the C-Pen Reader 2, which is this version of the device with the white casing. If you're using the Exam Reader 2 or the Secure Reader 2, the wizard and settings work in exactly the same way, although there may be slightly fewer options if you're using either of these products. Check the on-screen icons to see which options are available for your device. The wizard compiles all the most useful settings together in one place to get you set up and working as quickly as possible. You'll be prompted to start the setup wizard when you first turn on your device. But if you do need to launch the wizard manually, choose settings from the main menu and select run wizard. So let's take a look at the options in the setup wizard. The talking menu can be a useful feature for visually impaired users. However, for most users, the talking menu can become a distraction, so we'd suggest turning the talking menu off. The C-Pen user interface and talking menu language options differ for each product in the range. Currently, for the Secure Reader 2, there's English, Spanish and French. For the Reader 2, you have the addition of Italian. And with the Exam Reader 2, you have the options for Danish, Dutch, German, Portuguese, Russian, and Swedish. There are regular updates released for this range of products, so check our website for the languages that are currently supported. Text Language selects the language your device will scan and convert into speech. These will be the same as the menu language options you have available on your device, with the addition of Chinese and Norwegian for the Exam Reader 2. Once you've selected the text language, for certain languages, you'll be given an extra option to adjust the accent or dialect. This can help with clarity and comprehension. The right or left-handed orientation of your device can make a huge difference to how comfortable your device is to use. This setting flips the display, so you can use the C-Pen with your dominant hand while comfortably viewing the screen. You can also scan text in both left-to-right and right-to-left motions, which can help left-handed ergonomics. Incorrect right or left-handed settings will mean text will be scanned upside down. This will give you some strange results. If you are getting inaccurate scans, it's likely this setting needs attention. The dictionary language should be set to the same text language you've chosen. If you've chosen English as your dictionary language, you'll also be given the option to select a dictionary. The select dictionary setting gives you the option to choose from three English language dictionaries. The Collins Dictionary for British English and the North America Oxford Dictionary for users in the US. For primary or elementary users, we'd suggest using the Oxford Primary Dictionary. With its simplified definitions, we find this dictionary the best fit for younger users. You can set the volume level from 1 to 10. However, if you're in a particularly noisy environment, there are additional audio boost levels for added clarity. These are the main settings you'll need to adjust to get up and running with your device. To learn more about advanced settings like speed, punctuation, and word pause, watch our dedicated tutorial videos.